Hey, Alan here, and I titled this post in this video RV Lifestyle and Change because that's really the nature of the RV lifestyle. You get to change as often as you want. You can be here, you can be there, you can be at a beach, you could be at a mountain resort, uh, you could be somewhere in between, and you can really love every minute of what you're doing and of the kind of lifestyle that RVing um, really allows us to have. You know, the last three winters I've been in Steamboat and I'm making this video on March 20, literally in the last hour of winter. And it's been kind of a mild winter here. I got to get a kick that back in New Jersey, as I make this video, I think they're getting about six inches of snow in the last hours of winter. Um, but out here in Steamboat, it's been mild. Um, I have the greatest winter job in the world. I'm a ski instructor and I'm on the mountain every day and I love doing that. But after three seasons in Steamboat, it's time for me in my RV lifestyle to make a change. And I have a couple of major changes coming up, one of which I think you, you might be very interested in. Um, I am planning on leaving uh, literally in the next couple of days, and I'm going to be heading up to Casper, Wyoming. Now, up in Casper, aside from an opportunity to explore Wyoming and a tremendous amount of American history, as many of our uh, our uh, frontiersmen traveled west uh, along the rivers and through the valleys and, and made their way to Casper before they divided out to Salt Lake City or along the Oregon Trail or other uh, avenues to work their way west and northwest of uh, Wyoming. <clears throat> I'm going to be uh, affiliated with and working for a uh, RV dealership up there. And that's something exciting to me because I've never been in RV sales before, but I'm a full-time RVer. I've been on the road three and a half years. And I think it'll be a lot of fun helping others kind of fit the right RV into their lifestyle. And that might include yourself uh, if you're one of my uh, members of my RV lifestyle and how to earn a living on the road group uh, from Facebook. We're now nearing 8,000 people. This is a great example of something that you can do for a seasonal uh, job and you can stay in a place for a few months at a time and you know if you're into sales uh, picking up a job as an RV salesperson that might be kind of fun but there are a million and one things that you can do and if you're not a part of my Facebook group uh, certainly contact me I'm sure I've got some contact info up top here so if you're finding this on YouTube you can certainly click the link and get over to my post and that's where you'll get to contact me and all that and, you know we can we can talk about uh, whatever your thoughts are in that area or if you're looking for an RV or to upgrade or anything on service and parts I mean certainly I'd be glad to help you um, it's also an opportunity for me to learn more about RVs and more about RVing which I will in turn then share uh, on my blog rvacrossamerica.net and in my groups the RV lifestyle group on Facebook and also my RV across America group on Google Plus so I'm pretty excited about that and that's going to be happening literally in the next couple of days so by the time you see this video I may very well be up in Casper already um, after this summer I've also decided that in all likelihood I will be moving on from Steamboat as much as I love Steamboat and I love skiing all winter here I may very well look for new horizons uh, new trails to ski and uh, definitely it'll be skiing I love skiing all winter and uh, I'm kind of thinking west of uh, Casper, and uh, I'm not going to get any more specific than that right now, but I'll share that with you as the time comes. And I'll also be posting things that I learn as time goes on through stockups in terms of RV service, RV parts, RV modifications, upgrades, whatever that might be relevant to you as an RVer, uh, something that you're going to want to look at and think about. Anyway, I just want to take a couple minutes of your time. Thanks much. If you're finding this again on YouTube, click the link. It'll get you over to uh, my post, and you can pick up my contact information and also learn a little bit more about who StockUps is and whether it's worth taking a look. Uh, you know, even at a distance, there may be some things that we can do for you uh, while you're, uh, you know, thinking about getting an RV or maybe upgrading. Anyway, thanks much. Have a great day. Take care.